this Monday morning. And so far, Carson, seeing some showers in parts of East Texas, right? Mm -hmm. Just some showers up to the north of Interstate 20. Isaac, most of the area is not dealing with the rain. It's been hit and miss all weekend, and we're going to see hit and miss showers as well. Clouds and radar. Rain continues to pour in from the southwest, pushing off to the northeast. This is especially true for parts of Upshur getting into a Camp Titus in Morris County. That's where the bulk of the activity is right now. However, throughout the rest of the morning, I'm not going to rule out the possibility of rain on future cast 8 o'clock this morning. Showers and thunderstorms perhaps from Mount Pleasant up into the Texarkana, Texas area, and then this all starts to move off to the east into Louisiana and also Arkansas as well. That's 1 o'clock now heading into about 5 o'clock. We're just dealing with clouds at that point. We might even some see some peaks of sunshine for deep east Texas, but then we get cloudy again over night tonight. We're not dealing with any rain tomorrow morning at 7 o'clock, so we should be dry for your Tuesday morning commute. We're still dry through that lunchtime hour, so if you're heading out for lunch, go ahead and you can forget that umbrella. Showers and thunderstorms, especially for our western and southern counties. This is 5 o'clock tomorrow evening, and that all pushes off to the east. We get another break in the rain for 7 o'clock on Wednesday, and then we are watching for the possibility of more rain Wednesday afternoon. Temperatures right now, we are in the 40s and 50s, so it's a cool start. You'll want to remember those umbrellas this morning. You're also going to want to remember those jackets as well, because these temperatures right now, we're not used to them. It's been very warm over the past couple of mornings in that tracker today. While it is cooler this morning than what we have seen, we will see temperatures in the 60s and 70s this afternoon, which is above that average high, which is about 67 degrees for this time of year. And St. Patrick's Day, it's right around the corner. I am expecting temperatures in the 50s to start at 7 o'clock, 60s by 9, and then we will be in the upper 60s by 11 o'clock clock for St. Patrick's Day tomorrow. Now, as we go into your next seven days, showers and thunderstorms possible. Six of the next seven temperatures will be in the 70s through at least Thursday and big temperature change Thursday and Friday. That's going to be our best chance of rain this week. We get a break on Saturday, which is Isaac approved. He loves to fish. We will see temperatures in the 50s this weekend, so pretty cool compared to what we're going to see early on this week and then for deep east Texas, similar story. Lesser chances of rain today and tomorrow, but Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday probably going to be our best shot at it. But temperatures in the 70s getting close to 80 before dropping mm -hmm. back into the 40s by yes, Saturday morning. Coming, and it's still spring. That can happen at this time of year. All righty. Thank you very much, Carson. <laughs>